What is a prokaryote? The name prokaryote tells you a lot about the organism. Pro means before and cary means nucleus. This tells you that this organism was around before the more complex cell structures evolved like an animalia cell. A prokaryote is a bacteria. This has been around for millions of years yet is still the simplest cell form you will find. This is a unicellular, meaning that it is only a single cell, a simple cell structure with no nuke. This is a prokaryote cell. If you have a look on this diagram, you can see that there are several different parts to this type of organism. There is a cytoplasm which surrounds the DNA from this cell. There is the cell wall which helps protect the bacteria. The capsule, which is the bacteria's way of making you ill, giving you a virus. The plasmum membrane is the layer which keeps the internal liquid from leaking out. However, it does have a second function which allows liquid to pass through either way. The bacterial flanagan is what the cells use to propel themselves forward. Where mammal cells move around like a fish would to move forwards from left to right, these cells are more like a motor in a boat. They spin around and around to move forwards. Next there's the ribosomes, which is an acid that consists of RNA. These are the messengers that carry instructions to the DNA, so they tell the cell what to do. These can only survive in cytoplasm, but I'm not going to go into too much detail on this, because I don't know that much about them. The plasmid is a little more complex, though from what I understand, the plasmids are little strands of DNA which sometimes used in laboratories to manipulate genes. Although that's a basic understanding of what I understand, I'm not going to go into too much detail about this. Um, the last and final piece is the filly. Now I don't understand anything about this, so if you want some more information, you're going to have to find out yourself because I'm not too sure. But overall this is a basic explanation of what bacteria is.